Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions and thank you again for spending time with us. I want to talk to you a little bit about friendship today. We're going to come out of the book of Proverbs with a couple of different passages. In Proverbs chapter 16 verse 28, it says, A perverse man stirs up dissension, and a gossip separates close friends. Then if you go all the way down to chapter 17, in verse 9, my little personal indexing that I do here, it says, He who covers over an offense promotes love. Whoever repeats the matter separates close friends. I want to challenge you today. There are some people in your life that mean a great deal to you, and there are other people in your life that are merely acquaintances. What we're talking about today are those people that mean a great deal to you, people that are close friends, not forgive me, not Facebook friends, face-to-face -face friends. Sometimes I, I look at young people today and I say, you really don't understand friendship. The Bible speaks of friendship as someone that you speak face-to-face -face with, not, not somebody that you just text or... These are virtual friends, all right? This is La La Land friends. This is Looney Tune friends. Real friendship are people that you speak face-to-face -face with, people that you are close to. People that, forgive me, you want to grow old with in this life. But there are those around us in life that can separate us from close friends. A gossip, people that just like to spread gossip, can separate close friends. And the other thing that can separate close friends is people who go and repeat things rather than just covering over them. You know, everybody has a bad day once in a while. Everybody says some things they wish they hadn't said once in a while. Please forgive me. Everybody's human. But there are the type of people that will take that misspoken word, that will take that having a bad day word, that will take that thing that you did that you're really sorry that you did, and they'll go out and push that subject. They'll go out and repeat those things that you said, or they will simply spread gossip. And before long, people that you're very close to are now separated from you. Now, sometimes you have to ask, what were the motivations of these people? Why did they want to separate me from close friends? Sometimes they have no motivation. They're just a gossip. Sometimes they have no motivation. They're just a person that likes to pass things on. But what you and I have to learn to do in life is decide who to listen to. Let me say that again. We have to decide who to listen to. If somebody is close to us, don't listen to gossip about those that you're close to. If somebody is close to us, don't listen to every misspoken word or I'm having a bad day and was a little grumpy that day word. Don't let people separate you. Now, you have to understand in life, sometimes friendship needs to be protected. And you protect that by choosing what you're going to listen to.